Hey Knights, today's video is a live action of myself. Well, I know I did tell you guys that I won't be doing live action anymore in this channel. I did mention this on my welcome to my channel video. Well, now I regret saying that, so I'm sorry if I made you guys think that I won't be doing any live action anymore. Anyways. Today's video is all about the things I bring to school if you're a webtoon artist just like me or an aspiring webcomic artist someday and how you can manage school and webtoon plus YouTube at the same time. So without further ado, I'll give you to my intro. Take it or leave it, baby take it or leave it, but I know you won't leave it cause I know that you need it. Hey guys, so for today's video, I'm going to show you what are the things that I normally do when I go to school and work. Well, walking through all of the methods or the things that I normally do when I go to school and work. Aside from going to work, where I usually work at my place or my house, I normally bring my work to school so that I can manage my time wisely. Because I know time is gold and I know that time is literally one of my like one of my things that I really want to um, without further ado oh my god <laughs> let's get to this video First thing I usually bring to school are the most important things that I shouldn't forget are pencils, erasers, and sharpener. Also, don't forget to bring bun paper as well as ruler. You can all get these from your local bookstores or department stores, but I got mine from National Bookstore since I love all of their products and the price is very affordable. Second of all is the How to Draw Manga by Hurano Nagatumo, which was recommended by Tokyo Animation Gakuin College. And there's a special featured artist, which is Shinji Mizushima. He's an author and manga artist of a pretty known for his baseball manga series, which is Doka Ben. In this book, you can learn about characters, effects, backgrounds, and colors, clothing, special effects, flashes, and inking. I saw this book at National Bookstore, which was the only book left available, so I never hesitate on buying this because I want to improve my artwork, guys. So who doesn't? Or I'll just link a similar book in the description box down below, if I can find one though. The third one is the iPad. Well, this isn't the iPad Pro where most artists draw in it, but I just bring this for the sake of reading Eggnoid, because I love Ran and Eggy together. The fourth thing is my folder. This is where I compile templates from my mini storyboards and draft storyboards for final sketches 
Also, I compile all of the, my drawings here if I want to check or redraw my characters in different perspectives or art style. I got this for a dollar or 49 peso at National Bookstore, but you can find something similar to this in your local bookstore or department store. I recommend this one because it keeps your drawings organized. Last thing I bring to school are mangas. Aside from how to draw manga, these manga books help you get ideas from scenes and different perspectives. This is also a Filipino manga comic book from Black Ink Publishing. The ones I'm reading right now are Laws of Love, which is a yaoi manga or a boy's love manga by Herbs Navasca and Ros del Moncada. And the Sajo manga, which is My Mother's Wish List by Rina Francisco and Sita Alvarez. And lastly would be, hmm, let's see, oh, a lip tint. <laughs> okay, I'm always a sucker for lip tints, so I love lip tints and I'm, what I'm using right now is Tony Moly. Okay guys, I think that's probably it. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you love this kind of animation slash live action series, leave a like button for me to know. And if you're new around here, please check out my webtoon. It's Love and Real and Paradise Kiss. It's still ongoing. Also, it's gonna be on the description box down below, so check it out. But if you're already my knights and well, I give you guys some more tea to spill for my next update. Oh, um, don't forget to follow me on my socials. So I will give you guys some updates that I'm still alive and well. Now, off you go. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button.